excited about this one. Let me just quickly paint this picture. I, I want to talk to you if you've been thinking about or considering buying a blender. And I don't mean any blender. I mean, I know you were looking at the V brand, the V mix brand, the one that might have cost you $500 or $600. The one that's two horsepower. Folks, for the next 18 minutes, we are offering the Dash Premium Digital uh, Blender. This is not two horsepower, it's two and a quarter horsepower. This is 33,000 RPM. This is not 500 or $600, it is one, no, 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 actually forget that, scratch that. It's not five or $600, it's 399. Except tonight for us, it is 179. This is $220 off the price. This is like Black Friday came early. Producer Steve, will you please share with everybody how many of these we have to go around? 1,272. My good friend Kelly Deirdring is here. Our job, and this will not be hard, <laughs> no. is to wow you and amaze you and blow you away with what this can do. Yeah. And everything that, that Kelly shows you, I want you to compare to that five, six hundred dollar yep. blender that you were gonna buy. Now, the one thing is, when we're out, we're out. When we're done, we're done. Right at this stage, I have a few in red, a few in white, a few in what we call green, and of course the black as well. So there's about 200 in each color. Where do we start, Kelly? We start with the margarita. Okay. Duh! Of course. <laughs> of course we do, you guys. 1,400 watts of power. <laughs> That's more power than most blenders on the marketplace today, Thank including you. the $600 ones. Two and a quarter horsepower. Let me just give you a little perspective and then I'll make our margarita. Okay. Um, so the blenders that are under 100 bucks, yeah. they're about six, they're, they're right, you know, right around 350 watts. So under $100, you're talking 350 watts. A bar blender that's designed to mix drinks all day, every day, sun up to sundown, cruise ship blenders, they're about 800 watts. Okay. We're talking 1,400 watts, yeah, almost double. double the bar blender versions, which are thousands of dollars. So you can see inside here, I have tequila, I've got fresh mango, and then I have a little sweetener of agave. But most importantly, what I have is not fluffy TV ice, which I call the little gas station bags of ice. You got the hard stuff. This is the hard stuff that burns out the motors of under $100 blenders. Yeah. It will burn out your motor. This is why you have to buy a blender every year or every quarter if you're doing frozen drinks and mixed drinks. So this is the kind that comes out of your freezer. That's the kind that most of you have access to. That's what you want to make your mixed drink with, but up until now, you haven't been able to. Right. Now you can pop in any kind of ice, rock solid, and then this is all digital, so it's all built into the front. Now the $600 blender, you literally have to stand here and toggle it with your fingers. Drives me nuts. If it's $600, it should do my laundry, my friends. All right, so we're going to go down here and choose frozen from our digital display, and don't blink and you'll miss it. I'm gonna hit the start button, all right? Instantly emulsified. Now you can see that's a frozen drink done in about two to three minutes, or two to three seconds. But what's really happening is it's powering up and down on its own. It's toggling on its own. It knows when it needs to go up and when it needs to go down. That is the most sophisticated computer built into the front there. But what's most important is how it tastes, right? It's literally going to be the, the creamiest, dreamiest frozen drink. Yeah, yeah. You're not gonna see any chunks or any bumps. Just look as I use this spoon to pour out the consistency. It is so beautifully emulsified that your drink is not going to mix. So let's say you're at a party and you set your drink down. Look at the consistency of that margarita. That's the consistency that, like, you know when you're on a cruise ship yeah. or you're at an expensive, you know, uh, uh, nightclub and they charge you about 18 bucks for sure. a drink? That, and you go, ah, oh, it's a really good drink. That's the consistency you're gonna get with this blender every single time. It's creamy, it's dreamy, it's not gonna separate because it's completely emulsified. So every time you go in for a drink, it's all gonna be mixed together. You're not gonna get a lot of the mix or a lot of the, you ever gone for a drink and it's like all yeah. tequila yeah. and it's like not good anymore? That's not going to happen because everything is completely emulsified. Am I going nuts? Did you have a presentation of this earlier today? No. Okay, folks, I, I just want to point something out. Just from pre-sale of this offer, we have sold 1,730. That means people who are just scouring the internet for a great deal on a premium blender found this and went, okay, I'm going to get that. So in this airing already, we've just sold another 68. With everyone on the phone, there's fewer than a thousand. I don't want to sell this on price because it's the wrong thing to do. 
This is not a low-end entry-level blender. It's the elite. It's the best of the best. And we're going to put it side by side. You have to put it side by side with the other five and six hundred dollar blenders. You have to because it is side by side with them. I just want to point out that I mean we'll go along the line of wonderful demonstrations, but not only is this more powerful than that five or six hundred dollar blender, this is a four to $500 blender. Normally the price is 400 bucks, that's the HSM price. If you order tonight, it's 179, and it's free shipping, and it's flex pay. So even if it's this, even if you had your heart set on one of those other blenders, and uh, tr for heaven's sake, you gotta try it. I'd rather save three or $400 and put it back in my pocket and try this. I know what you're gonna feel when you try it. You're gonna say the same as the hundreds of reviewers. As said, they read is, the reviews. Is, I'm so glad I got this yes. one. Okay, we're gonna keep going. Another 20 just sold, let's yes. go. All right, you guys, so a lot of people invest $600 in a premium blender sure. because they know it can do hot soups, hot fondues, you know, hot cheese, whatever. You don't need to invest the $600. Read the reviews. If you're wondering what brand Adam's referring to, the reviews state it. We can't, obviously, state it. It's a competitor brand, it's about $600. I'm gonna choose soup in here. Now this has enough power to actually cook my food. There's no heating element on the inside here, right. my friends. It's all based on friction, two and a quarter horsepower, 1400 watts, 33,000 revolutions per minute. Inside here, I have all vegetables, some broth, and then I've got some butter. You could add your own salt, pepper, garlic, cilantro, whatever you want to add. You can see this is raw vegetables. They're not softened. They're not roasted. We're going to make a beautiful, fresh, organic vegetable soup with the press of a button. And then to my left, your right, we're going to actually do some beautiful creamy chocolate fondue with just two mm. ingredients, a little cream, a little chocolate. You could add some fresh raspberry, fresh orange, totally up to you. But what's so cool is that it actually has a soup button built in. So you don't have to stand here and toggle and wonder if I'm doing it right. No guesswork. The machine, there's no guesswork. So Dash has taken all the guesswork out. So I'm going to get both of these moving. We're going to wheel this away and then we're going to come right back to it. It's about five to six minutes. These will be cooked to about 180 to 190 degrees just based on friction of alone, my friends. It's not a heating element on the inside. Guys, we have 800 left with everybody placing orders right now. You're going to hear the power. You're going to see the performance. You're going to see what two and a quarter horsepower looks like. 33,000 RPMs looks like. I did just get word as well. Producer Steve, who many of you know from, from HSN, he's been one of our superstar uh, senior producers for, did you say 18 years, Steve? Steve just bought this. Steve, what color did you buy? You, you got the white. Steve got the I mean, if you want to know what Steve got, Steve got the white. And he is a man of great style. Guys, it is an amazing yeah. offer. I mean, it's, it's, it's not like it's the good or better. It's in the best realm. I mean, that's what you've got here. Even the brains behind it are all automated. That beautiful digital display, it's phenomenal. Fewer than 700 now left at this price if you want to get in. Again, do it with a 30-day money-back guarantee on a flex pay as a gift for somebody. If you want to eat better or eat healthier, or maybe you want to make your own smoothie, it's fantastic. But as we're finding out, this is for a whole different range of things, from soups to, to frozen drinks. And by the way, seven-year warranty. Seven years my child will be in almost high no not quite high school but I mean you're That's my, quality. Yeah. seven years my car came with a three-year warranty my car cost a little bit more than this <laughs> seven years dash stands behind this product you read the customer reviews you guys have rated it so highly because you use it all the time and Adam just mentioned smoothies if you are trying to get healthier you're trying to maybe lose weight or just get that natural burst of energy rather than the caffeinated burst of energy a green smoothie is a really great way to do it and we actually know know how much you guys love your smoothies so we built in a button that says smoothie now this button will toggle up and down it knows exactly at what power to go down at what power to go up it knows exactly how much time your smoothie needs but what's more important than what's on the inside is what's not on the inside right no water no liquid no ice now I don't know very many blenders in the marketplace that can take solid food and turn it into a liquid without adding a liquid so if you've ever seen a blender demonstration whether it be on infomercial television in the big box locations they're always adding orange juice or coke coconut water, water, because they need that liquid to prime sort of their motor. We're just going to take solid fruits and vegetables. So you can see we've got a whole bunch of spinach. We have our pineapple. We have our grapes. We have a whole orange behind a cucumber. This could be your protein mix, your chia seed, your goji berries, you know, I, whatever you want to put into your smoothie.
smoothie and then you just select smoothie so you can't mess this up okay and then you hit start now the tamper comes included and you're just going to push down the ingredients until they get completely emulsified which takes about two seconds no liquid in there. no liquid whatsoever <laughs> show you the difference between this and other blenders that will cost you five, six hundred dollars. And don't get me wrong, the, 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 the biggest thing about this presentation, it's not a hundred and seventy nine dollar blender. Yeah. It's, it's a four hundred dollar blender. blender. It's just that you're getting it for one seventy nine, which and is why even our producers buying it. Well, we never do free shipping and a great deal. If no. you've ever noticed, it's usually like a whole bunch off, but then we charge for shipping. And fair enough, as it, as it works, you know. Um, but this time you're getting the great deal yeah. and the free yeah. shipping. But most importantly, look at this smoothie. Let me steal that. Can I try spoon. this? Yeah, I thought you were going to go for the margarita, actually. Well, I missed, I've got I a long missed, night ahead. I misjudged you, Adam. <laughs> I gave you a little too much credit. It's been a long day, Kelly. I'll be on the floor asleep, I can assure you. <laughs> Which would actually make for an interesting show. <laughs> All right, friends, look at this smoothie, though. There's no chunks, there's no bumps. You will not be chewing your smoothie. It actually fits the definition of a smoothie, which is smooth, um, <laughs> rather than chunky. Clues in the name. Yeah, it clues in the name. But have you ever been to the smoothie store? Um, where they give you what's called a smoothie straw. Oh, that. So you ever seen a smoothie straw? That's a thing. Look yes, at that. They're yes. about this big around. Thick. They're about as big around as, you know, a quarter. And it's it's because the reason is, um, you know, they're not sure that there's not chunks in their smoothies, right? The it's actual the smoothie up. locations give you a smoothie straw in case you have to suck up a big old chunk of food. This, you can use a regular straw. It's like you're drinking apple juice or a glass of milk or, you know, it's like a thick, beautiful smoothie. Yeah. But there's no chunks, no bumps. No, no and chunks. how does that taste? It's, it's, not, it's so smooth. And this is a gorgeous recipe, by the way. Guys, it's an awesome product, and I think you can see that already. They are telling me there's about 600 left with everybody on the phone. How, how many minutes do you think, Steve, before, we, like 10? Well, about 10 minutes we've got. I have been, I've been clutching it like it's <laughs> my entire life savings here. Oh, the book? This book. <laughs> this is the ultimate blender cookbook if you're looking for some great inspiration highly recommend the ultimate blender cookbook it's 24.95 you get nearly 240 pages of just great great ideas i have 275 left of these books uh, also a big customer favorite as well so maybe you want that to go along with it i'm going to keep drinking the smoothie and we'll show you as much as we can in the remaining nine minutes well this is a recipe that comes included by the way you get 20 recipes mm. today when you get your book so add on that book is awesome as well but this recipe comes included um, but you can see it's one ingredient peanut butter can you guess what that ingredient might be Adam hmm? in my one ingredient peanut butter is it peanut butter is it peanuts, <laughs> it's peanuts. peanuts. Sorry. shocking trick is question. that shocking <laughs> um, it was a trick question it was a very serious question because if you've ever gotten a jar of peanut butter and you've turned around and looked at the label there's like 20 mm. ingredients it's peanut butter it should be one ingredient every time so you can <laughs> now make your own we did the honey roasted here you can do any kind of peanuts raw organic up to you there's actual blender man Manuals. They're usually the ones under $100 that sure. say do not attempt nut butters because they don't want you to get mad at them and return their product when it burns out their motor. So the manual, I've seen it, it written in black and white, don't attempt nut butters. With ours, you can attempt nut butters all night and all day. So on this one, I'm going to use the manual settings. So I've shown you a lot of the pre-programmed settings, but now I'm going to just go straight to high. So you can see you can time your manual um, in terms of time and power. So all the way up to high, and then I'm going to hit start. And this is no oil added, you guys. It's actually going to extract the natural oils and turn this into a creamy peanut butter. Here we go. Watch the magic before your very eyes. Again, the, the numbers don't lie. This isn't two horsepower. It's two and a quarter horsepower. This is 33,000 RPMs. This is a 1,400 watt blender. If you just do a quick Google search for 1,400 watt blender with two and a quarter horsepower, you'll find very few deal tonight a really killer deal and i'm thrilled that you're loving it the white's nearly gone what was the other color you just said steve the black okay so if you want white black or red certainly call in the next and also the green the green okay 
Oh, the green, there's only 20 left in the green. Okay, so take one last look at the green. The green's nearly completely reserved. You know, it's a beautiful green, it's a different green, it's a, it's, a, it's a spicy green, it's a gorgeous green. Okay, so you did it. Well, a little note about that green, it looks yellow on TV for Does some it reason. It's very green, so when you get it home, I don't want you to be surprised. On your television set, it looks a little bit yellow, well, at least on mine at home, I always mm. like to point that out. It's a beautiful lime green. All right, here's that peanut butter, you guys. It's totally creamy. If you wanted a chunkier peanut butter, you could have stopped a couple of seconds seconds before I did, but that was 15 or 45 seconds, excuse me, and I didn't even use the entire time. So if you have 30 seconds of your life yeah. to spend making fresh yeah. rather than processed, sure. you are now eating less preservatives, you're eating less sodium. My dad, he's got to get lay off the sodium. Peanut butter has a lot of sodium. I was going to give you that celery, but something tells me you'd rather an apple. How do you know me I don't so know. well? Most guys don't like celery. It was just I a good guess. Like yeah, I don't know. It's a thing. Thank goodness you did yes. that. Yes. All right. So beautiful fresh warm homemade peanut butter let me give you a little tip if you want to pay for this blender make your fresh peanut butter make your fresh almond butter or cashew butter put it in little jars and go to your local farmers market and sell it for 10 bucks a jar <laughs> you'll pay for this blender in one morning that's expensive stuff at the mm -hmm. farmers market and all they have is a very high power blender sure. and they're mixing it up and they're adding their own ingredients Gorgeous. okay how are we doing on the soups it's over done. here? It's done. So we're back to where we started just a couple of minutes ago. Um, if you're a raw foodie, uh, this has not been cooked uh, over 212 degrees. So if you're somebody that wants to keep that nutritional content, yeah. I like to point that out. This is about 190 degrees. So it still keeps all the nutrition inside. But look at the difference in color uh, to what you're seeing there and what you typically see in a can of like tomato or vegetable Absolutely. soup. This is real food, what real food looks like. You don't have those bright, you know, neon, vibrant colors. Um, and that's because a lot of times in cans of soup, there's tons of sodium, uh, there's preservatives, but sometimes there's artificial coloring. Right. And it's such a shame uh, because we're trying to eat healthy. We think, you know, a can of soup must be healthy. Sure. It's only healthy if you know the ingredients you put in. That's why Dash's motto, and they stand behind it so well, is unprocess your food. If you missed it, this was just raw vegetables. They weren't cooked, they weren't softened, they weren't roasted. Raw vegetables and then our own spices and seasonings, we did add a little butter that's up to you smells divine it does smell divine and then right next door we also did a beautiful Talking fondue of divine. i know so if you're a gentleman out there and you've ever purchased the chocolate dip strawberries yeah. you ever done that for yeah, chelsea of okay of course you have how much was it not cheap 70 bucks usually and that that you know and plus plus shipping overnight because they can only do it overnight if you just you would save that money you know doing it yourself you'd pay for this blender in two batches of straw in two valentine's days you would <laughs> You would have this paid off, my friend. But look at that fondue. That was two ingredients, and you can dip your own oh strawberries. Gosh. But what's even more decadent than a chocolate dipped strawberry is a chocolate dipped pineapple. So now you can do the, you know, star fruit, kiwi, bacon. I've, I've heard people doing chocolate dipped chocolate bacon. Chocolate bacon, yeah. We, we did little sponge cake. Or you could have a party and have little platters sitting around, and everybody can dip whatever they want to oh. dip. So you can now make it by pressing a single button and that button says soup. I mean, obviously. And it's fully automate, uh, yep. automated. There's no guesswork. And that's another thing. It's not like a toggle switch on this. Yes. You'll see the digital display. It's just so darn easy. Uh, we are wrapping this up in the next four minutes. I, I can't give it higher marks than than 10 out of 10 because I mean, it really is the best of the best in the world of blenders. Let's put it this way. We don't sell a better blender than this on HSN, on any brand. This is the highest quality blender that we sell on this network. And it's not $400 today, it's $179. So if you've been kind of thinking about a blender, you want to do some frozen drinks, you want to do smoothies, you want to do soups, homemade soups with all real, real, real ingredients, this is a chance to do it. A chance, and again, if, if you and I went to the store, um, with Kelly and we said, okay, we got uh, we got $179 to spend. We wouldn't walk away with a blender with these specs. We just no wouldn't. Way. We'd walk away with an okay blender, but it wouldn't be like this. That's why it's such a great offer. Obviously, it's the only presentation today. We sold through over 50% before we even got here. Um, I want to go to Maureen in Florida, yes. though, Kelly, because Maureen in Florida, I heard, just bought this. Maureen, how Hi, Maureen. are you this evening? I am great. Thank you. I just cut off of work, so I'm so excited I was oh. able to catch this stash. Oh, you're going to love it. You got the best deal. You really did. So you've been thinking about buying a blender, Maureen? Yeah, the other blender that you're talking about, I've really wanted one for the last couple of years. But this seems to be just better than that by far. It, you're going to love it. You made a really good decision, and you're joining thousands of customers that have chosen this one over the $600 one. 
I have a lot of Dash products and okay. I love them. Especially oh, well, like the egg cooker. Oh yes, <laughs> love great. my egg cooker. Good well, so, for you. So Maureen, that will have given you the confidence then to know that this would be a good buy, I suppose. Absolutely, absolutely, oh. I'm thrilled. Oh Maureen, we're thrilled as well. Congratulations. Enjoy it Maureen. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Have you. a great night. Good night. Guys, just I'm, I'm going to let Kelly kind of wrap up things for you and do as many final demonstrations as possible. I just want to say really basically what Maureen said. You can only compare apples to apples. And for many of us, we dream about a certain brand of blender. And it begins with a V and it ends in an X. And it's a great blender. It's an awesome blender. It's a blender that does so many things. But I, the truth is... This blender does all those things as well. This blender is actually more powerful than a lot of the other brands' blenders are. And this blender, normally at $400, at $399, we're able to stand here and say, you know, it's about $100 cheaper than that other brand. We're not saying that tonight. We're saying that this brand is now, I mean, we're like $400 cheaper, $350 cheaper. It's $179. If you go to hsn.com, you'd be able to see all the specs, the horsepower, the, the wattage and everything else. So you could maybe do a side by side and see, compare apples to apples. But the truth of the matter is, the reason why this is flying is because I think people are seeing it and saying, all right, I'll do it. Remember this looks better, is prettier, in great colors, has a, an automated display, push button action, it's an awesome deal. So. Why spend more if you don't need to? That's well, what I'm I trying to say. I think there's so many things that I'd like to do with $600. That's a down payment on a really nice cruise. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, it's a very expensive to put $600 down on a blender. This one comes with a seven-year warranty. So you have that satisfaction knowing that in seven years from now, something happens to this blender, yeah. they're going to replace it. And I'll, I'll just tell a little secret. I hope uh, Evan Dash isn't watching. Tell but us. He said, you know what? If somebody contacts us in nine years, we're still going to help them out. And I was like, <laughs> wow. I mean, that's what I'm saying. What an amazing company. All right, so I'm going to um, go ahead and I'm going to use manual, but you could use frozen. This is skim milk and frozen strawberries. These strawberries just came out of the freezer. Do not thaw them. Okay. Again, do not thaw them. You want the consistency of the sorbet. So I'm going to pop this all the way up to high. Again, you have your choice if you want to use a preset or the manual. And it says 30 seconds. We're going to add a couple of seconds. I don't think I'll need them, but you can choose the time as well. I'm going to hit start. <laughs> laugh because every time this growled like that I would get like uh oh something's going on is there something wrong no that's your blender that's what two and a quarter horsepower sounds like it's supposed to make that noise that's it working for right, you right, right. that's it going right through the strawberries oh, right through the skim milk that. and making a sorbet that has a consistency of soft serve but the the calorie count there's no added sugar uh, low, you know very low cal in calories this is a dessert you could eat every night and not feel guilty it's only the natural sugar from the strawberry. I did not add any sweetener. If you want to add sweetener, uh, you certainly could add your own sweetener if you like a stevia or something mm -hmm. like that. Your call. Um, but this could be frozen bananas, frozen mango, frozen blueberries. Um, that was skim milk, but I, I don't do, uh, drink a lot of dairy milk, so I would do like a coconut milk sure. or a soy milk sure. or an almond milk. Totally up to you. You now control the ingredients. Look at the back of a box of sorbet and from your grocer. They have 15 ingredients at minimum. Yeah. It's frustrating. There's artificial colorants. There's preservatives. Bless their hearts. The manufacturers have to put preservatives. They don't know how long it's going to sit on a shelf right. until you take it home. So they're required to put preservatives. But you're not required to do that at home. When you have the tools to make fresh, I want you to do fresh. If you want this book, there's only two dozen left. So I'll put this down in a second. But if you want the book, it's called The Ultimate Blender Cookbook. It's a great, great book. And it's $24.95. And you, you get like nearly 250 pages of just awesome, awesome some recipes with great inspiration. It's beautifully laid out. I mean, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous cookbook. So definitely ask about that if you'd like it. It's called the Ultimate Blender Cookbook. Okay, final 90 seconds, my 90 darling. seconds is plenty of time to make my own gluten-free flour. So in here, I have a dollar bag of white rice. This could be oats or chickpeas or almonds, whatever you know to be gluten-free. Normally, gluten-free flour is about 10 bucks at the whole uh, health food right. store. So watch from the bottom of your screen up. I know they'll get an awesome shot. You'll literally see flour being made right before your eyes. Well, here we go. Look at that. The thing is, 
when you buy a blender like this, you're done. It's yeah, not like done. you buy another one next year. Do you know what the problem is? A lot of us, and we've done the same, you buy a blender for 60, 70, 80, 100 dollars, it's never good enough. Yeah, you're right. Isn't and, it true? And it burns out and you go, wait a minute, I spent, you know, hundred dollars on that. It will burnt out because the motor uh, you know, didn't work right. Yeah. It wasn't high enough horsepower or it had plastic yeah. parts. Yeah. We haven't mentioned this is all steel to steel, metal to metal construction. There's no plastic parts in terms of the gear. This is Triton, so you could stand on that and it would be fine. So you're talking about about the highest quality you can get. This is literally the highest quality you can get. Do I have time to do coffee? Uh, do we have time to do coffee? There's always, no, there's no. Time, I mean, no. Well, this is only like 150 left, so there's no time. Oh, okay. Kelly Deirdre, thank you. But you can grind your coffee. I wish she'd come to just, just uh, he, do he it. He's going to start.